Let's talk about that last game against Rockford here on home ice. Uh, a shootout loss, but a great effort by you guys. Just take me through how you saw the game. Yeah, obviously a little back and forth there through the first two. And then um, I think just, uh, you know, a really good push by us at the end after going down one with, you know, five minutes left there. I think uh, kind of speaks to the resilience of the group, um, something that, uh, you know, we know we have in that locker room and, and a lot of character in there. Uh, yeah, obviously uh, come back in the last 10 seconds there and, and score one and get that extra point. Uh, I think that was uh, definitely something to build off of uh, heading into tonight. It was your first full game without Declan Chisholm in, in the lineup back there on the blue line. Um, a guy who's obviously a staple on this Moose defense core, but uh, what can that do for you and maybe some of the other guys to continue to step up and fill those roles in Declan's absence? Well, yeah, like you said, obviously Chis is a staple in our lineup and uh, for a good reason, one of the you know, best defenseman in the American Hockey League. and um, But yeah, obviously with him out, um, he was a guy that uh, created a lot of offense for us from the back end. And so, um, you know, I don't think there's going to be one guy that really fills that role, but uh, more just as a group uh, collectively back there. I think, uh, you know, if we can all chip in a little bit, uh, try to create some offense from the back end and uh, help those forwards out, uh, I think that's just something we're going to do as a group back there. Speaking of the forwards, one guy who's been consistently scoring as of late has been Jansen Harkins. I mean, he's a guy with NHL experience, previously started here in the American Hockey with the Moose. But uh, what have you seen from Jansen's game as of late? I mean, he just seems to be such a workhorse and find the back of the net. What have you seen from the blue line? Yeah, I mean, definitely a guy that uh, we're lucky to have on our team. Um, just uh, tremendous skill, obviously. Like, you kind of see, you know, every night um, he just kind of finds a way to get it done. Um, you know, he's scored a couple late goals for us here in the last two games. And, um, you know, I think uh, throughout the season, one thing, uh, you know, sometimes we've struggled to do is create offense uh, as a group. And he's definitely a guy that, uh, you know, is a huge piece to that. So, um, yeah, I think for us, it's just, uh, you know, we're lucky to have him here right now. And, um, yeah, he's just been, uh, he's been excellent for us. Going down the stretch here yourself, Milwaukee, Texas, you three seem to be just battling out for those final, for those uh, top three positions anyways in the Central Division. How exciting is that for you guys to be battling for spots, especially after last year where you didn't really have much movement? And how much can that benefit you uh, leading into the Calder Cup playoffs here? Yeah, I mean, I think that's just kind of where you want to be at this time of the season is, um, you know, in a race for, uh, you know, potentially first, but even, even if not first, uh, you know, home ice heading into the playoffs. And so... Um, yeah, I think it just, it really makes it fun coming to the rink every day. Obviously, we've got the standings uh, up in our locker rooms, and so see that every day, and, um, you know, we're, we're right there with the, you know, 10 or 11 games to go here, so definitely makes it a little more exciting and, and a little more enjoyable coming to the rink every day, uh, knowing where we're at. And it continues, of course, again today against Rockford. Uh, what did you like about your performance last time? What are you expecting to do here tonight? Yeah, I think, uh, you know, we had a good meeting uh, after the game and then before pregame skate today, just... Um, you know, making sure we're sticking to our identity, um, giving ourselves a chance to win, um, which uh, I think uh, everyone's pretty confident in there that, uh, you know, I think we have a solid game plan and uh, now it's just going about going out there and executing it. Um, and I think uh, by, by the time the puck drops, we'll be ready for that.